Now, from KFDX3, Texoma's Weather Authority, with Chief Meteorologist Michael Bowling. Well, warm temperatures are sticking around as we go throughout the rest of this week today. Highs in the 90s to triple digits across the area. However, a few showers and possibly some thunderstorms do come through later on as we go into the late evening hours for tonight. And then there is another rain chance later on this week. You'll see that again here on the seven day forecast here in just a moment. All right, yesterday's high 99 degrees, so 17 degrees above our average of 82. And we tied a record high of 99. How we said back in 1933. Yesterday's low 75 degrees, so 18 degrees above our average of 57. Looking at this afternoon, high is still very, very warm and just plain hot for the western portions of the area as we go into this afternoon. You get 96 for Wichita Falls, 97 for Lawton, but up to 103 for Vernon. How about 102 for Altasquana and Kroll? Still 101 for Seymour and Knox City, 100 for Throckmore, and still 98 though for Archer City, 94 for Jacksboro, 91 for the high in Bowie. Now as we look at the wind speeds here, winds are going to be gusting up over 20, over 25 in spots, but even over 30 miles per hour as we get later on into this evening. That's also when we start to add the chance for a few showers and storms, especially in the western portions of the area. We'll talk more about that on future casts here in just a moment. As we go into tomorrow, still winds gusting up over 25 miles per hour as we go throughout the afternoon. Now as we look at the highs here going forward, when, or highs just generally about 10 to 15 degrees above average throughout this weekend into the weekend. Again, average time of year, 82 degrees. You see mid to low 90s throughout for Wichita Falls. Western portions of the area likely seeing triple digits continuing as we go throughout this week. All right, so looking at future cast here as we go into later on today, nice clear to mostly clear skies for much of today, but looking out to the west by around 6 o'clock here, a few showers and storms starting to pop up across the panhandle. You'll start to see those starting to move into the western portions of the area by about 930. Some of these storms actually might make it a little bit earlier than that. This forecast model might be a little bit slow here, but then those uh, storms will continue as we go into the hours around midnight, but then die off closer to about 2 to 3 o'clock in the morning. And then we have clear to mostly clear skies throughout the day on Wednesday. A few more showers and storms pop up in the panhandle on Wednesday, but they do not make it to us here in Texoma. So looking at the Arrowhead Roofing Thunderstorm outlook for today, a slight risk for severe weather across the western portions of the area, marginal risk for more central portions of the area. Strong wind gusts, large hail could be a concern. Tornado threat, not really a concern here. When we have this warm of temperatures, tornadoes aren't really a concern. But also with warm temperatures, there is the potential for localized heavy rainfall, and that's because warmer air holds more moisture. So not necessarily for Wichita Falls, but you see the blue areas that are a little bit farther off to the west. We could actually see some spots in local areas see up to two inches of rain if they get a heavy thunderstorm. So there is the potential for some heavy rainfall in the western portions of the area. But today's high, 96 degrees, windy and warm. Showers come through later. South winds gusting over 25 miles per hour. Tonight, low 68 degrees. A few showers and storms coming through, especially for the western portions of the area. South winds gusting over 25 miles per hour. Here's a seven day forecast now. Showers come through later on today. Highs in the 90s throughout this week with another rain chance on Friday.